Welcome to the 2008 Boo Shop. Our championship round is about to begin. Let's meet our competitors. First up is Joe, who won his qualifying match by mounting a spoiler onto the back of his 1985 Honda Accord. <laughs> He's a pretty big douche, all right. But so is Luke, who punched his ticket to the finals last week by wearing a Che Guevara t-shirt and eating a Big Mac at the same time. And they're off! Luke starts things off with a predictable color pop hat tilt combo, all while pretending as though he knows how to see walk More like D-Walk, Bob. <laughs> Joe counters by revealing his new tattoo. What language is is that, Tom? Not sure, Bob, but it definitely translates to douche. Not to be outdone, Luke has just worn sunglasses to a casual poker game among friends. Douche, douche is wild! Joe now tosses on his high school letterman's jacket. Can we confirm? Yes, he graduated six years ago. Back to Luke, who has just joined a co-ed City League softball team and is taking it way too seriously. Oh, I think he got some boobage on that play, Bob. Classic douche! Speaking of douche, Joe has just joined a pickup basketball game in which Neither team has designated skins. Oh. Will he? Wait, oh, will oh, 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 yes! He has taken off his shirt anyway. This man has douche in his veins. Luke knows that if he's going to recover from that blow, he needs to pull out something truly douche-tacular. Here is where we find what Luke is truly made of, and I hope for his sake it is douche. Douche. Luke starts off by failing to locate New Zealand on a world map. That's good, but he's gonna have to do better than that. Oh, and he has! That's legal documentation that he has officially changed his name to Chad. Oh my douche. What? Oh, he is what? actually photoshopping abs onto his profile picture. And this contest is over. Joe has thrown in the bandana. Till next time, everyone. Thanks for watching. Douches. <laughs>